Hi, I'm Suzanne Skurlock Durana, the developer of Healing the Pelvic Floor for Women. And I'd like to speak with you today just a little bit about what goes on in that workshop and what you would get from that workshop, or if someone you love comes to the workshop, what they would get out of it. This workshop has been attended over the last 15 years that we've been teaching it by a mixture of women who have pelvic floor issues. They've had surgeries, they've had traumatic childbirth, they have uh, perhaps survived abuse of some kind, or they've taken a fall. Um, those kinds of people who have actually experienced trauma and really need help in letting go of it and releasing it from their bodies, minds and spirits. The other half of the group that will often come to these workshops are hands-on therapists or psychotherapists who really want to understand more deeply about the anatomy and the physiology of their pelvic area, which we go into in depth, as well as what kinds of things they can do in order to heal or help heal the people in their practices. And sometimes people come with a mixture. You might be a therapist who has pelvic floor issues. I actually created this class and developed it out of my craniosacral therapy teaching uh, skills because I had a very, very difficult delivery myself that left my pelvic floor with a lot of dysfunction that needed help. So I looked around, gathered the skills, and began to grow this class long ago in order to help not only my own healing, but the women around me who were also finding that they did not have the healing available that they really needed and wanted for this area of their bodies that is like the engine of the body, the pelvis. Most of the time, students experience a multitude of different kinds of skills coming together. So you would have, you're going to experience and learn about anatomy and physiology in this area of the body. You're going to experience movement, breath, and sound information that helps you to reclaim and open up your pelvis. We will be working with yoga or Feldenkrais, some form of a guided work that will help you to begin to be able to move and get more agency over your own system than you might have had before. We will also be doing sacred ceremony, all done clothing on, where you get to receive as a woman um, the kind of touch or uh, healing energy that you would like to have for this part of your body and your anatomy. So someone might hold your sacrum, like we do in craniosacral therapy with a sacral hold. Someone may hold, as I said, clothing on, the pelvic floor. We might hold the front of the pelvis. You may find that you need to have some other area of your body held in this sacred ceremony. And we do two rounds of the ceremony that are very, very wonderful. What women also find is they come out of this with their attitudes and their beliefs about their bodies changed. They're able to let go of the limiting beliefs they walked in the door with, perhaps from their ancestry, and walk out with a whole new message about who they are, what their body can give to them, and what they have to give back. I, I started it because of my own healing, and also because I realized that even in teaching craniosacral therapy, which is a very intimate, non-invasive form of body work, that there was nothing specifically for the pelvic floor. There's a sacral hold and release, there's lumbar release, but there's nothing actually for the pelvic floor. You can go to the physical therapy world and there are specialists who go internally, vaginally, for working with the trauma that might be there from delivery or rape or abuse. But again, that's not what we're doing either. So I realized that there was a huge gap in what was being offered to women, and so many women had issues around their pelvic floor with nowhere to go to get the help that they needed. So I've had women who were as young as 19, who had grown up very meek and obsequious in their family of origin, and who had never really stepped into their power, which is resides primarily in your pelvis, to 77-year-old women who had had five, six, seven children, and never been able to let go of any of the trauma 
of any of those deliveries or anything else that had happened in their lives. So I've seen a huge range of people in these classes, experiences, trauma, skills, gifts. It's a wonderful, warm circle of women where you are supported in a very safe way in doing whatever healing work you need. Come join us.